Hey guys, Adam Frimmer here from DIYPhotography.net. We're joined here by Bobby at the stand at Black Magic IBC 2019. We're going to talk about this cool switcher they have coming out. Check it out. DIY Photography's coverage of IBC 2019 is sponsored by SERP, Better Films, Zion, a gimbal for everyone, Manfrotto, Imagine More, and Spiffy Gear. Lighting for storytellers. Hey, Bobby, what's up? What do you got here? Hey, so this is our new HM Mini. Uh, it's a little four input HDMI switcher. It's designed for people that need to get to the web quickly and easily. So uh, you plug in your inputs and you can switch between computers or cameras, no problem. And then it goes straight to your computer and looks like a webcam. Oh, okay. So basically plug and play switcher device. You want to put something on the internet. Cool. So what kind of person would need this? Um, and how would you, how would they justify this? Well, you know, it's, it's almost like anyone that, uh, people that need to switch multiple inputs on the web but don't even know they need a switcher because they don't know what a switcher is. So we've tried to make it simple to use uh, so that the person actually switching could be uh, the person on air. So, you know, you have a camera input and then you switch to say some graphics or gaming or whatever you're doing to describe. You can even do a little picture in picture so you can have both the images on the same time. Uh, we even have a um, chroma key, so you can chroma key graphics straight from your computer. Uh, and it doesn't matter what resolution you plug in, the switcher handles it and knows to just make everything work. So you don't have to worry about frame rates or any of these kind of things. And you can go out 1080p to the web. And, um, you know, it's, it's one of these devices that could become more sophisticated if you use our software. But really, to just get going and go really easily, that's what, we're, what we build here. Awesome. So from my understanding, I used to work in, uh, I have a communications degree and we used to play <laughs> with switchers all the time. They seem like pretty expensive things. Yeah, I mean, this, will, uh, this is something that's uh, unbelievable. I mean, with 289 euros or say 295 US dollars, uh, you, you're into a four input switcher and, you know, you'd expect today switchers have come down in price. But years ago, I mean, uh, 30 years ago, this would have cost $50,000 and couldn't do as much as this. So, I mean, it's really kind of crazy, but uh, the idea is we want to get uh, a lot of people enabled to be able to do better content on the web, whether it's, you know, for fun or even in the business situation. You could plug this into Skype and uh, do a conference call with somebody and show some, you know, PowerPoint or whatever on one screen and then have a picture of you and, and, and communicate a lot better and, uh, and easy, just plug it straight into Skype, looks like a webcam. Cool, and I imagine you can even pl plug a webcam into it. Well, sure, you can take the output of a webcam if you need it to. There's a couple of mic inputs, so you can add extra microphones if you need it. Embedded audio through the HDMI. I mean, it really has a lot of power in a, in a relatively small uh, footprint, obviously, uh, but also just um, easy to use, and then it can become a little bit more sophisticated if you use the software that we have. And then people will learn how to use our ATEMs, and as they grow uh, in size, they'll move up through the line. Cool. So, assuming that I love this <laughs> and I want to get to know to use the software. What kind of cool things can we do with the software? So with the software, we have ability to do a little bit more uh, transitions and, and, and keying. Uh, we could build macros. So there's different things that we could do in the software that you wouldn't necessarily do from the hard panel. Uh, but the idea is that you could have somebody uh, maybe loading different graphics for you on the software while you just uh, change transitions here. So we can also do audio mixing in the, in the software. Uh, yeah, so it really has uh, some great uh, tools that, um, you know, and you can run multiple instances of the software even. So if, you know, one person was switching, one person did the audio, one person did the graphics, you could actually do it that way. So it really is flexible. It doesn't matter how many uh, instances of the software. So it's, it becomes, uh, it can become sophisticated if it needs to be, or it's just, you know, simple transitions and, uh, and you're away. That's so cool. So you said it's 289 euros. And when can we expect to see this on the market? Right, so we'll see them uh, coming out in November, and uh, you can get a whole lot more information at blackmagicdesign.com. Awesome. Well, Bob, thanks so much. Thank you. That was Bob here at Black Magic, talking to us about the new ATEM 4-channel mixer. I'm Adam Frimmer from DIYphotography.net. Don't forget, we have a $5,000 giveaway. You can read more about that in the description below. Check us out. Oh.